good morning friends uh, today we are seeing about uh, one of the manuscript in the journal machine learning which is a very reputed uh, journal so here you can see that uh, this journal has uh, its own credentials like uh, it has uh, impact factor of 2.672 into the 90 and 5 years impact factor is 3.157 takes uh, minimum 79 days for the initial first decision and 319 days for the submission to acceptance it has good number of downloads 99 so we are trying to see about the latest issue Volume 110 issue 4 April 2021. In this, we are interested in this article learning programs by learning from failure. Okay, so this uh, article is a, one of the good research article and you can see the length of the article is just like 56 pages. So initially, uh, if any new uh, comers are there in the research field, they may just drop out this article by seeing the length it has, but actually it has a good knowledge and information in this. See the article name, Learning Program Spy, Learning from Failure. So it's a part of machine learning where it's going to uh, learn by its failures and trying to improve its uh, logic and program so now let us just see uh, the overview of the article it has an abstract of uh, explaining what is ILP inductive logic programming means what that's uh, an approach called for learning from failures okay and then explaining about what are different type of uh, techniques they are using in this one and uh, what are the experimental simulations they are going to do so like uh, our experiment results on three domains toy game problem robot strategies and list transformations and then giving uh, different type of uh, constraints on which these uh, things are applied and what are different future aspects of this uh, Pieces. They are given that one also. Then it has an overview where an introduction part is there, and uh, along with this, uh, you can see different type of uh, ILP systems. Uh, what are available till now? That are proposed and shown. And uh, a good amount of related work is given here as related to the 2.1 inductive program synthesis, inductive logic programming, recursion, optimality, language basis, answer set programming, hypothesis constraints, and all those. Then they had provided problem settings that is logic preliminaries. 3.1 problem settings, 3.2 problem hypothesis space 3.3 generalization and specialization learning constraints from failures 3.5 and you can see the things goes on but no need to worry everything will be easily explained and you will get the things 3.5 and 3 constraints something and 4 is proper implements what is this LEFT approach and all those what is this Cooper algorithm and validity redundancy and efficiency constraints for this algorithm that was given language bias constraints hypothesis constraints then tests lastly constraints for this and coding classes so much things are given here. You just imagine how good this paper is and what for example correctness was proposed by using the Lehman and its uh, proofs 
then the fifth section goes for the experiments okay under experiments they are given questions here can constraints improve learning performance compared to unconstrained learning how well does proper scale will work how well does proper Cooper perform compared to other ILP systems some more materials has been given <coughs> the results analysis is done here where they had given the proper charts and we need to see the difference of performance between different algorithms and on some more robots material Research analysis for that material, <clears throat> then list transformation problem and research analysis uh, for that one. Scalability for these all things, then uh, the results and largely conclusion and limitations. We are at page number 44. So, limitations and future work is also provided here. Mm -hmm. So which is very very good thing by using that future work you can go for further research and a good acknowledgement is, is provided. You can see that we have came at page number 47 and the paper is completed and from there 47 to 56 the regarding materials what they have used the research so that was uh, given till the end here and then goes the references which we are having from page number 56 a group number of differences of three pages so this is the overall set this paper and uh, explaining such a paper is a big job here because uh, if you are a newcomer you may understand only 5 to 10 percent of this paper and understanding more than that uh, up to 40% to 30% understanding is a good, good level of understanding. So we will try to make the things as simple as possible and try to explain this paper which is one of the latest papers in machine learning journal and uh, try to be with us to learn more things. Thank you for your time and if you are interested just uh, subscribe my channel and uh, continue with uh, this here okay right. thanks we're going to stop here